Here on this quaint street in Prague, Czech Republic, is the house where Christian Doppler lived between 1843 and 1847. Doppler lived in the house while he was conducting research at Prague Polytechnic, which is now Czech Technical University. It was in 1842 that Doppler published his famous work on the colored light of the binary stars and some other stars of the heavens. In it, Doppler explained how stars moving towards the observer appear to have their light shifted towards the blue end of the spectrum, and stars moving away appear to be red shifted. This is because, as the object approaches, its waves are compressed proportionally to its speed, making the wavelength smaller and thus the frequency higher. This effect, known as the Doppler effect, is used in astronomy, police and weather radar, medical imaging, and explains the apparent change in pitch of a siren passing by. A few blocks down the street and through the square of Old Town Prague, one comes to the home of Johannes Kepler. Nearly 300 years before the time of Doppler, Kepler worked for the astronomer Tycho Brahe. Kepler analyzed many of Brahe's observations, allowing him to develop his three laws of planetary motion. 1. The orbit of a planet is an ellipse with the Sun at one of the two foci. 2. A line segment joining a planet and the Sun sweeps out equal areas during equal intervals of time. And 3. The square of the orbital period of a planet is proportional to the cube of the semi-major axis of its orbit. The contributions that Doppler and Kepler made to astronomy and physics, though hundreds of years apart, will forever place Prague on the map of important scientific cities.